next? Where are we gonna go next? Obviously, we need to go to fucking Spain. Nope, nope. We going to to England, dude. To oh. the old country. To Castle Proserpina. Hmm. Yeah, of course. Seems interesting. Let's uh let's talk for a bit about how fucking crazy the plot of this game actually is. So. Uh, yeah, the plot to this game is fucking insane. Yeah, is it uh, about <laughs> something about um Elizabeth Bartley is trying to bring back a dragon, dude? That Medusa head exploded. I'm sorry. <laughs> what is that? It's shooting shit at me. But anyway, it's a dick. <laughs> anyway, we'll go back to Elizabeth Bartley, right? She's trying to resurrect herself a Dracula or two. And that's all uh, I really know. Yeah, so it gets more crazy than that. Uh, Dude. Because. Uh, Dude, hold on a second. Dracula is her uncle. He, what? He's your uncle? She yeah, and there was there was an era of peace following oh. the Great War between humanity and Dracula, and with oh. Dracula dead, she decides that she wants to bring old Drac man back. That makes and, sense. Uh, yeah, and so she conducts an unholy ceremony, which starts World War One, and gives her <laughs> possession of human souls from Europe. <laughs> What's this unholy ceremony? I, I don't know. Was it creating this fucking stage? I, I, I probably. Oh my! It's probably this, whatever caused this. Yeah. I'm, oh, I see what's going on here, but it's not easy on it's the eyes. Extremely not a good idea to make a level like this. Um, the game takes place in 1917, so I, I'm not sure how that fits in with the fictional timeline of World War One. Should be right <laughs> about the end of it, but who knows? Right. Uh. Yeah, and then. Uh, you got a couple of characters that nobody cares about, but, uh, one of them is whoever this John Morris guy is, and the other one is a guy whose girlfriend was transformed into a vampire for some reason. My girlfriend was transformed into a vampire? Which guy are you? I'm Eric Lacard, dude. Yeah, your girlfriend's a vampire. That's bullshit, man. The, the Countess turned her into a vampire for some reason. That fucking bitch, dude. That bitch. <laughs> Yep. This room's upside down in case anybody's wondering. It's stupid. I'm done with it. Oh, and uh, the Countess uh, is a real person who existed in real life. Who was did a serial killer. Did she really killer. bring back a Dracula? She did not bring back a Dracula, but she murdered a bunch of people. So maybe she did. Maybe she did bring back a Dracula. She though. could have know. brought back a Dracula. She's probably using their blood to fucking feed her Dracula. Oh! Mm. There's the first boss, and he just explodes in one hit now, I guess. So now you're <laughs> trying to... <laughs> Now you're trying to stop um, Dracula. Uh, well, you're pushing bring I'm, back Dracula, I guess. I'm on the case, dude. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna fucking joke, man. Why is that guy such a bitch now? <laughs> God, the game just got really easy all of a sudden. That's all. I, I guess I, I'm. I suppose I got stronger as the game went on. I, I... <laughs> I just fought regular skeletons that didn't blow Make up like up that Make up your own lot, reason. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Is it time to go fight Dracula already, dude? I guess. It's usually the same as that. It usually goes the other direction. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Maybe it's not going to be a real Dracula then. Probably not. Oh, shit. It's death, dude. I should have known. I should have known. <laughs> oh, and he wants to play a card game, huh? <laughs> I, oh, I oh, and and the John Morris guy is related to no! uh, the Morris guy from the Dracula book. Dude, I'm fighting the Birdman again. Good. Oh, is it going to give you a fucking boss rush? Is that what's happening here? It's looking like it, huh? This is awesome. I'm definitely going to lose my fucking spear. God damn it, dude. Fucking get a couple of those off while I can. Yeah. And there goes the spear. All right, great, thanks. Uh, I never don't touch his to balls. <laughs> you know me, I love touching balls, dude. <laughs> I love that noise he makes when he spins around too. It's so pleasing to my ears. <laughs> and you're dead, Birdman. Look at you. And with three quarters me, of your bitch. health left. That's gonna be all right. Hopefully, it fucking heals me though. I, 
if I have to fight like four or five bosses in a row and not be healing, I'm going to be pissed. Uh, he doesn't look like he's going to heal you. Oh, no, nope, he's going to shoot fireballs at me. Now I'm half dead. Real classy, buddy. Oh, turkey! Oh, wow. Okay, never mind. He exploded into food and you're going to eat it for some reason. I'm a hungry man. Well, you wouldn't eat that meat? If a skeleton exploded into food, would you eat it? Please <laughs> oh. answer in the comments. <laughs> oh, it's fucking Mr. Roboto again, dude. I think, <laughs> I think they're weaker this time around. He's taking, nah, he's still taking one hit per time. Oh, fucking race car mode. <laughs> this has got a pretty this easy the worst pattern. race car. <laughs> It could be race car, it could be baby crawling across the ground. I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> Whoa! I'm not... Just... Just die, dude. Poor cog baby. Yeah. Never got to be a real boss. <laughs> and you're dead. They're like, dude, Castlevania, you know what? It's all about cogs. Let's make a boss out of cogs. <laughs> no. No, no. Call me crazy, but when I played through all the previous Castlevania games, what really stood out to me as the star of the show was the Cogs. <laughs> Everybody loves them. Oh, what if we me. just made a game about Cogs? Cogsylvania. Ah. Uh, that Jetsons theme, too. They like Cogs in that show, didn't they? It was only actually toward the end of development that they changed it to a regular Castlevania game. This was going to be a spin off all about uh, Cogs, you yeah. know. Round toothed objects. Oh, fuck, fuck. I'm glad I get to fight every boss in the game again before I proceed. This is great. Oh, but think of all the memories we're getting to, you know, rehash. Dude, I killed him halfway in like one hit there. That was nuts. Must have gotten like a critical hit? I don't know. He's just a chump, I guess. Yep. Suck it, buddy. Woo! I do like being able to do this, though. This feels good. Yeah. Jump. Just jumping. Yep. Jumping extra high. So strange killing a boss and then not getting an orb. Yeah. I'm not really sure why this guy explodes into food instead of just giving you an orb when you kill the uh, boss. Okay. But... Oh. Okay. Well, that's... Alright. Huh. I, can deal with... I can deal with that. Oh, First that's an old platform here. Oh, there we go. No, no platforms. That kind of sucks. I don't know what the fuck this is. Okay. Not much you can do about that, apparently. This is so much easier than, like, Castlevania 1's Grim Reaper, minus the holy water trick. Right. Like, without that, he's unbeatable. It's not as, uh, great, though, as the Simon's Quest. No, that, that's the all-time number one best Grim Reaper fight, dude. <laughs> it's like, hello, Mr. Grim Reaper, and Oh, no, there's goodbye. a spooky monster in here. I'm just going to walk out the other door. <laughs> we got him, dude. He's dead. Grim Reaper's dead. He, he's apparently extremely dead because he made a fire tornado. Yeah, that's how you know. But he didn't oh. drop an orb. <laughs> no, he didn't, dude. <laughs> that happens at the end of a level, I guess. He didn't even Shit. explode into food. <laughs> yeah, he should have. That bastard. I have like one fucking hit left and I'm dead. Oh, dude. Check it out. It's her, man. Oh, fuck. Ah! Oh, my God. But she's a Medusa. Is that a Medusa? Orb Medusa. Hey, look at that. She can't fucking hit me. What? Oh. Yeah, it's totally a Medusa. It's like what? a really what? gnarly Medusa. <laughs> nice attack, Medusa. With orbs. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, she definitely can't hit me when I'm doing that. That's pretty funny. Yeah, I go right oh through that God. shit. You oh. figured out how to become invincible and then immediately died. Yeah, until I get hit by her fucking tail made of balls. I told you not to touch balls. Uh, in my defense, those balls were definitely touching me. <laughs> I wanted nothing to do with those balls. Let's fucking kill this stupid bitch. Pew, pew. The Genesis, I make shitty fucking noises. Right. This should be pretty easy now that I don't have to do that, though. So she's gonna do that, do that, and then she's gonna tail whip. Easy enough. Oh, and then she's gonna make a pathetic reach towards me with her arm. That is a just pathetic attack. 
Oh, that's fucking funny. Uh, I wish it didn't spin me around the other direction when I did that super jump. Though. That's my only complaint yeah. about it. I don't think she's gonna be able to sad to watch. Isn't it? <laughs> Let's just make her make a pathetic reach. No big deal. You say you are not a boxer. Dude, she is the most worthless boss in every Castlevania game, though. At least, at least she takes some damage in this one. Yeah. Had a pound at least, good. you know, it's just a different type of Medusa. It's uh, got orbs, got some balls. Yep. It's more bally in nature. You know. It has fire breath for some reason. What the fuck? Oh! <laughs> I didn't expect yeah. that to happen. Oh. Alright. Well, <laughs> uh oh. Good night, good night sweetheart. I, was that. Is that it? Did I, you beat it? I think I killed Dracula. I did it. No, nope, no. Nope. You killed she oh, Dracula. Dude! Crank it oh up, man. Oh my god, but there are more candles. It's the Super Castlevania 4 music, dude. But in shitty Genesis form. <laughs> you hear it? Yeah. Just jam it for a second, man. Here comes the content ID. I can hear it. Oh, goddamn content IDs. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Fuck. I don't know. Sometimes they get it, sometimes they don't. Ah, uh, here's the Dracula stairs, I'm sure of it. Oh. Uh, but they're still facing the wrong way. Of course they are. Oh, there goes the axe. What? <laughs> Nobody wants that anyway, man. In a money bag. I always love the points bag in Castlevania. Yeah. You know, for points. And whatnot. Because you really want those points. Everybody cares a lot about score. Mm. Oh, look, dude. He's made of bats. <laughs> who who would have thought? Oh, God damn it. And you gotta fucking hit him in his head like every other time. And he's, it's and just he's, a regular old Dracula fight. Yeah, and he's purple as fuck, and he has orange hair. That, that's nice. <laughs> that's how my Dracula always looks. <laughs> God damn it, dude. This is stupid. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. It's classic oh. fucking Dracula fight, that's for goddamn sure. Bats come, bats go. You hit him in the face. And he shoots fireballs at you. Yeah. And you rinse him the feet. Does he turn into a cookie monster? I can't wait to find out. We're gonna have to- Oh! Ah, oh, two hits on you, you stupid shit. Pull some new fancy attack on me, that's what happens. Man. <laughs> this is the easiest regular Dragon the Five ever encountered, though. Wow. Yeah, this is... Um... Disappointing? Oh. <laughs> yeah! Actually, I lied. The easiest one is, uh... Isn't that four where you, you just kill him as Dracula and that's it? That's all you gotta do. Uh, yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, yeah that was pretty disappointing. At least this way turned into the Grim Reaper, I guess. I don't <laughs> yeah, fucking why know. Why turned into the Grim Reaper? <laughs> it makes sense. Oh, I've okay. turned into a boss that you've already fought. Ah. I got lucky there. Oh, well, that was easy. Oh, dude. Now he turns into Cookie Monster? Get ready for his true form, huh? Cookie Must Monster. That's a Cookie Monster uh, with a with a mouth what? for a dick, dude. Look at that thing; it's got a mouth for a dick. <laughs> what? <Holy shit. laughs> I'm not entirely sure what we're seeing here. How many mouths does one monster need? Oh, I'm gonna tickle his feet. Yeah, I got him locked in, dude. He's fucked. Oh my god. Really? Wait, he turned colors, dude. He's red now. He's angry. Oh, oh, fuck. He's no longer stuck in the corner. He yeah. Me. Now his cock's blowing fire at me, dude. Shit. God. Eh, it's dead. Oh, my God. Okay. I'm fucking... <laughs> I'm disappointed. Oh, I thought I had him stuck in the corner. Uh, that's what happened. He changed forms again. I had him stuck, but every time he changes forms, he comes out of it. Well, we'll try hard. God it's damn it, dude. clever Dracula. I like how the uh, hardest form, apparently, though, is this first one. Because it takes the longest. Yeah. I kicked the shit out of this. That fucking death sequence was a joke. Where he's a Grim Reaper. But the other forms also hurt you in, like, the first one. Yeah, that's true. If I can keep him from hurting me in this form, he's probably fucked. That's probably the ticket. 
Gotta patiently get the right distance, and then jump and fucking stab me in the fucking face! Stupid asshole. <laughs> Well, just, why does he have so much life at this stage? Ah, I want to point out that my uh, my skirt is blowing in the wind inside of the castle here. It's super windy in here. Can you see it? Yeah. Yes. It's always kind of super windy. I know. It's just a windy place everywhere in the world. God damn it, I got It is pretty cool that you travel all over Europe in this one, though. It's got things that are nice. This game's got things that are nice. Got things that are just some okay too. things to it. I mean, my biggest complaint is definitely the sound, and that's just that's just a chest. That's just yeah, every Genesis game. Look at the explosions sound like fucking turds, or it's like. Genesis is just it's just a fart machine. Oh oh. <laughs> get down, boss! Get this. Which is amazing, you know, because the SNES was pretty good at fart trumpets. Right. Not everything sounded like a fart, but it did those fart trumpets that every game. <laughs> oh my goodness! All right, motherfucker, it's time. Oh man! I just noticed that every attack he does emanates from his penis. Well, what's the deal with that? I, I, I don't know, dude. But I, I got him in a good pattern here. This is actually pretty easy. I'll, I'll do this all day. Stupid fucking Dracula. I'm just so confused by this Dracula. It, it is confusing. I don't, I don't understand who, who thought the... confusing Dracula. The giant mouth cock thing was going to be a good idea. Oh, wow. Oh, shit. Had him, had him locked. God damn it. It's just such a weird fucking game. It's just so weird. Look at the background. How strange is that? The plot, the Dracula, mm. all of it. It's just weird. <laughs> yeah, it really is. It's weird even for a Castlevania, you know? Yeah. Okay, now he's a bone master. <laughs> oh, wait. Are those coming from his mouth or his back? Uh, they're coming out of his back. Oh, God damn it. My theory doesn't hold up. I think those are just his ribs. His ribs are just... He's got that many ribs. Well, no longer will you be a problem for this current game, Dracula. See you next <laughs> time, buddy. Wait, what comes after this one, then? Is... Uh, what do you mean? What, tra like, what Castlevania? Is it like Castlevania 64 or something shitty? Like, chronologically, what one comes after this? or Yeah. Like, like in, in the game's time? or No, or? no, real people's time. Oh, uh, I guess Castlevania 64. Oh, fuck, man. That's gonna suck. Yeah, that's gonna be atrocious. Supposedly, whatever the other Castlevania was on the 64, I don't remember the name. It's called, like, uh, The Dark it, Knight or something stupid, yeah. Supposedly, it's not that bad. <laughs> Only Castlevania 64 is supposed to be <laughs> Dude, did you, did you see that ending? Uh, yeah. <laughs> the castle fell in and that was it. <laughs> Oh, uh, you beat the game. Endings. You beat the game. Here's a, here's a two-second ending. Congratulations. <laughs> That's a tradition in these games, though. That's the worst one I've seen yet, though. Usually it like, gives you a second to look at it. Right. That, that, that was literally like two seconds. I mean, all right. We did it. And we got Gollum dancing. <laughs> and then fucking Birdman's back. I wonder what his real name is. Does it tell us? I, I assume. It's doing monster roll call, so it's got to be. better. Oh, it's Gargoyle. <laughs> oh. That, that's a Gargoyle. <laughs> yeah, that makes All sense. All right. I hope this one's called Mr. Roboto. Special design. Tat. Huh. Cogboy. What's his name? Gear Steamer. Huh. Gear Steamer? Where does he steam? I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, this is Mothra. I wonder what her name was. Mothra. Better be Mothra. This was made in Japan. Princess yeah, of with Mothra. Moss. Oh. Okay. What? Do they mean moths? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> 
Yeah, mods well, I got that one mods, right. be sure to comment in the comments. <laughs> the debate rages on. Yeah. A lot of debates. Special thanks to these folks. Wait, do you think this one's called Special the thanks to Medusa? Mm -hmm. What? Oh, shit. Look at that grab. That Look at that Medusa, grab. Right. Oh, my God. Oh, bats. We did it, dude. I feel so good right now. I'm beating Castlevanias left and right. I'm gonna have to go back and beat the other ones that I didn't beat, though. Fuck. Dracula X. Ugh. Castlevania 3 first, and then Dracula X. But yeah. And Castlevania 64. <sighs> dude. I don't know, man. I really don't know. I ran that game one time, and it was awful. I don't know if I could do it. You will, though. You will. I'll try.